I do not like what WWE is doing with Becky Lynch and Liv Morgan. In this video, I'm going to tell you exactly what I'm talking about because Becky Lynch obviously is going on to WrestleMania and she is challenging Rhea Ripley for the Women's World Championship at WrestleMania 40 in Philadelphia this April. We also have Liv Morgan. Ironically, Liv Morgan and Becky Lynch, well, they got a little bit of history, right? Liv Morgan, she returned at the Royal Rumble. They mixed it up in that match. And since then, Liv Morgan, well, she went on to Elimination Chamber. She competed in the Women's Elimination Chamber match. And she fell short. She fell short to Becky Lynch. Since then, Liv Morgan, really since the Royal Rumble, but especially Elimination Chamber, Liv Morgan has put her focus, she has set her target on Becky Lynch. And I think it's a horrific idea. And here's why. They're slated to, to work an a upcoming match on Monday Night Raw. Whatever. It doesn't matter what the outcome of that is. In the end... WWE is making a major mistake with Liv Morgan and Becky Lynch, and I can tell you exactly what they're doing, because does anyone in their right mind actually believe that Liv Morgan will beat Becky Lynch in the eventual outcome of this feud? Okay? No. And why would they? Liv Morgan, she's been on the sidelines for a while now. Like I said, she returned at Royal Rumble. But she needs to be built up more. She, the fans are behind her. They they always have been behind her, especially in the last year and a half. Becky Lynch is going on and most likely going to dethrone Rhea Ripley as Women's World Champion at WrestleMania. Do you really expect her to lose going into that match? Do you really expect for her to start putting over Liv Morgan? No. Then why would they? Why would she put over someone else when they're trying to build up her as a title contender. Well, they wouldn't because you need to build up Becky Lynch in order to get to her spot to dethrone Rhea Ripley as Women's World Champion. So who do you do that with? Well, I thought they were doing that with Nia Jax. I thought that was their way of doing it, right? She's a name that she can beat. Nia Jax, she is what she is on the card. But no, they pivot to Liv Morgan. We're only a few weeks away from WrestleMania. You need to be building up Liv Morgan now. Because coming out of Mania, then you can have her feud with Becky Lynch. Or you can have her feud with whatever. But when you have an over baby face, as much as Liv Morgan is, and I understand there's been some teases of, of heel turn there, and I'm okay with that. Either way, the, the amount of support that the fans are behind Morgan. She's good on the mic. She's pretty decent in the ring. But more importantly, she gets a reaction. I mean, she had a heel turn at the Elimination Chamber in Australia, right? Tiffany Stratton, she turned babyface. I just think this is a bad mistake by WWE, and I hope they realize what they're doing.